it's yeah difficult to assess, isn't it? Because it depends which way it goes. Because if we get the sort of deal where we we manage to stay in with all the EU environmental legislation, that's good because that's actually better than much of the stuff that we've had in the UK, apart from the five-year uh, carbon budgets. Um, if we got a very extreme Brexit and we're chucking out all the environmental legislation and, and the you know extreme uh, right wing is just doing what it likes and, and raping and pillaging um, the environment, it's very bad news. Well, as, as I'm sure you know, we rely a lot on um, EU projects to fund scientists. That's one thing is the funding, and the other thing is the actual scientists. So we get a lot of people coming here from mainland Europe, fantastic young people that do such a good job. And um, while it would be good to grow more, you know, home people, I think we'd definitely be losing out in terms of the expertise in the universities. So um, uh, a number of academics, young academics from Europe have gone home um, because, not because they've lost their jobs or I don't think they even particularly feel unwelcome at the university, I hope not. It's just the whole aura, the whole country, and they're thinking, well, might as well go home now rather than leave it a bit when I have to go. The government has um, promised to continue up to the end of the contracts of any EU grant that's already started before Brexit. So those ones are okay. But as I think you're suggesting, what's going to happen after that? We have no idea. I mean, when we had all the, all the talk coming up to Brexit, it was, oh, it would be great because we won't be giving the Europeans all this money and we could spend it all on whichever is your favourite topic, ten times the value of all the things that people wanted to do. Um, so unless the government's going to produce a lot more money for direct science, it won't happen. Um, I, do, I do think that scientists, by nature, and particularly in climate science, are, are very collaborative. And we just couldn't do things, really, or not, not as well, without talking to people across the world and working on projects together. So let's hope that will continue, even if, even if the funding gets reorganised.